I should probably unmute myself when I'm <laughs> going to do my intro. <laughs> okay, I'll just leave that open next time. <laughs> well, anyways, hello anyone who may be watching now later on on YouTube. Get in here along with Drakir. And welcome yet, yet again to the Saboteur. I get the feeling we'll be beat this game for quite a while longer, and well, I haven't gotten bored of it so far. If a game is this long, it has to be good. Uh, for us to keep playing it, yeah, but so far it, ha it has been good and it's very entertaining. I mean, yeah, I just mean that if you make a very long game, you don't you feel that the. Yeah. If you make a very long game and you fail at make it entertaining, that's bad. There's the mouse. I've lost it for a bit. Yeah. And let's continue on. Last time we learned that there's going to be a Grand Prix and nice spawn in uh, in Paris. And we are to participate and win so we can get up close to the Nazi generals and probably just shoot our way back out. Yep, and today is so clean, pretty clean as, as ever. So, I feel pretty clean as clean as I feel today. Okay. Uh, I, I still need to find a way to get freaking Nitro to work because it. Yeah, I had. Um, the annoying thing with Nitro is that I tried it once, but then it. Um, it tried to only work with automatic um, resubscription or something I forget what the name would, would be and well I, the only way to basically get it to stop was to block it on PayPal and there's the pigeon shooting thing again and I haven't found out a way to reverse that yet yet so I, until I figure out that, I can't get uh, Nitro to work. Maybe I'll try maybe something through my cell phone if I can get it to work through that. But yeah, basically on Discord's end, yeah, it's rather bullshit that it only wanted to work through automatic re uh, repayment. Just yeah. let people pay every single time different yeah, under that. Because automatic resubscription yeah that has a very known history for being scummy as all hell yeah basically the, the trick with that is that many people may have probably known or figured that had it happened a cutscene you've done it oh, seeing her again is like finding a lost child she's still hell on wheels the crowds were reluctant to part with her. I only wish Jules could be here to see this. Get my toolbox. We have work to do. You got it, boss. Okay, looks good. Whoa. Okay. I think I'm in love. Uh-oh. Rolf Becker. Your new identity. You'll be posing as an amateur German driver. My friends in London made all the arrangements. What now? Now, I suggest you start practicing. You'll only get one shot at this, and there's no trophy for second place. Of course, they'd probably only allow German racers anyways. But yeah, as I was saying, the trick with those automatic re you know, subscriptions is that they, they typically give you a month or two or maybe even three for free on a, but after they basically expect you to forget that you signed up for that and the, they will give you those months for free but after that it'll automatically go into yeah well automatic resubscription so the hope is that they'll for the hope is uh, they want you to forget that you signed up so a note for you. Okay, off with you. So that, uh, yeah, you forget that you're going to be s paying every month after that. I have intercepted the communique regarding Dr. Kessler's daughter, Maria. Meet me at the Hotel de Ville. Come quickly. The girl may be running out of time. Regards, Bryman. 
Okay, that's that's storyline for guessing professing a bit. Also someone we met last time, Kessler. A defecting Nazi well, defecting German the scientist. Yeah, and for first topic, I agree I'm not caught of that uh, manner. And yes, that is to be the, the doctor. And I just realized something. Every time I hear Kessler, I think of a food that we speak for Kessler. Yes, it is only one level different. And oh no, what Kessler is. I know that it's something else because I have heard the word before, but I can't pin a meaning to it. Uh, I'm pretty sure it has something has to be in it. I just know if it's, it's some kind of stew or something else. It's not Tesla <laughs> something because that is a very it is a somewhat similar but still very much more known. Yeah, that's why complete is something else. It's... I'm sort of expecting that either one of these will be closer. Well done. Okay, so it would have been better if I just run him over. Yeah. Not that there's much difference between running over a Nazi and punching one the fuck out. <laughs> apparently, <laughs> apparently he had some sort of heart monitor because those guys beelined it. Okay. Right, as I was saying, I didn't want to drive him over because I didn't want to drop one out of my face. Then, yeah, he just had to do it for himself by the judgment. Yeah. He just then asked for it. Yeah, that laser graded karma that it's called on... ...on TV tropes. And are they going to get up? Nope. <laughs> so I'm <laughs> heading out. I'm really sad it's been surprised you got only the long time to Killed that uh, five people by reckless driving. And the two of you have been able to do that. Yeah, so far the most have uh, been able to get up. I think I'm guessing this thing is just a bit too fast to uh, fall below that damage range. Yeah, either get up or avoid it. By What's a thin the word? Hair. News on Maria Kessler's whereabouts. She's being held in the Hotel de Ville. Then I'll go in and take her out. Yeah, yeah, I thought so. I see two options. There is a oh, heavy gauge telephone line that runs across the street. Sounds like the quiet way in. What's plan B? Kick down the door and kill everything that moves. Subtle. I don't suppose you know where the holding cells are. I'm told they can only be reached from a concealed passage from the library. Any other surprises I should know about? I overheard talk of a German special forces unit. Some kind of terror squad. They made a bloody reputation on the Eastern Front. Now they're here. Taking orders from Dierker. You might want to take extra precautions. I'll come loaded for bear. Okay. Yeah. I thought it was a Brian was her father. Uh, but no, no, that was the other guy we have. So you know, to know. Yeah, Brian is well the the German resistance member. Yeah, he he was a Jew, I think. Uh, yeah, he is he is Jewish. He did say that. Uh, well, he didn't say that, but he he, he basically said it in anything but. Yeah. Uh, did he did he to say Jews, right? Uh, I think so. Uh, technically, the most uh, the more accurate word would be uh, Hebrew. Oh. But base. I I recently saw a video on this from a. Overly sarcastic productions, and yeah, that basically uh, Jewish counts based bo as both a religion and uh, an ethnicity. Yep. And as a kid, I did not know 
No, it was a technicity. So when I heard about the Second World War, I just thought it was a Bloody holy war, basically. Like in the Crusades. Okay. Still horrible, though. Still horrible. Just yeah. yeah no, that the detail it just got worse in my mind. When it finally clicked me, the evil of uh, the, the Nazis. Yeah. And there are a lot of people who uh, well, don't really get the full picture of it all. Because, yeah, in certain places, people are just a bit unwilling to uh, talk about it. Well, that was easy. Yeah. Now the library. Yeah. I think it was uh, in the seventh grade and when I learned this. And I... not many kids uh, are too eager to learn the details. Hermann. Actually, you said to no one named that. Okay, and Hans is now uh, off looking for Gretel in La La Land. Hansel and Gretel. I, I know, I was about to just realize. Are there those the only German names we know that are so typical in German? <laughs> yeah, those are basically the German and stereotypical names. And I thought I had the uh, silenced pistol <laughs> with me, but apparently not. Uh, but there, there is also Hans and I think maybe Gunther? Yeah. But that one's more. That's what you can find in Scandinavia and German. Also Fritz, typically, I think. Fritz? I, well, Fritz is a more overly Germanic uh, name, as in both. Oh, as a As I German and uh, other countries of the same region. Yeah, I just got... Uh, I was just about to be in Durban. I, I was wondering... What country is he mean with Fritz? I don't know a land called Fritz. Uh, have you never heard of <laughs> Have you never heard of that uh, country, Fritzerland? Wait, all right, there is one called that. Yeah, it's Switzerland. <laughs> oh, hold on. I'm here to speak about one of the nations that mix up Netherlands. Oh wait, it's a three. Tunisians? No. Oh, uh, God, I put what? Friesland. Well, here's the library. Now, That's where's that passageway? It's one of our provinces. Got gotcha, you, you bastard. What is that? Something about truth and the uh, hello. Surprise, asshole. <laughs> okay. I like uh, that. Some sort oh, of propaganda yeah. book. Oh, wait, why was it written in English? Yeah, probably so they could uh, spread it beyond uh, the German borders. Because uh, America had a pretty big fascist party going as well at the time. I think the, the guy who led that actually had a shot at uh, possibly becoming president at one point. But I think he managed to fuck himself over it at one point. Thankfully, I think. Yeah. It's... Oh, hello. Are you happy now? Eindringling im Keller. Sicher die Gefangene. Auf Wiedersehen. So-called master race isn't all too uh, clever. Well, <laughs> <laughs> oh, they did have a big, uh, a very big mentality of follow the leader. Though you'd think they'd be a lot smarter about if the leader just gets shot to death that they would stop following. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. 
At least you would expect them to try to take cover the better. Yeah, they can take cover behind the corpses of the of the compatriots. Oh. oh, those are the terror squads. Jesus, where did those freaks come from? Okay, that was a lucky grenade. These are fictional, right? Uh, yeah. Oh, hello, terror shotgun. Uh, yeah, <laughs> I'm pretty sure this thing did not exist. I'm pretty sure drum magazines only came up after the war. I guess uh, they, they are the ones we see in a small... Who is that, Devlin? Hero. Is that you? Who wants and, uh, to know? Hmm? My brother in arms, mon ami. Please, let me out. There is a lever in the office. <laughs> okay. We have an you art place. <laughs> Merci, Sean. You want to Luke's fellas? We oui. we gotta get out of here. Come on. You can never have too many explosives. The door is locked. Mm, looks too heavy to blow with a charge. Maybe I can rig something up with that boiler. Maybe we can find another way. <laughs> Pardon? Uh, where is it? Uh -oh. So find way through door. Okay, are they going to keep spawning? Oh. <laughs> uh, yeah, this, I think this counts more as a freaking LMG. M L what the what does that stand for? Hmm? An LMG large machine gun. It's oh, wait. I ducked again. It was, it, was, it was MLG, you said. Not LM. Oh, my brain. Okay. So they said either screw with the boiler somehow. Or find or another way. Um, no, oh, yeah, they are going to keep spawning. Okay, yeah. It's like it's better to blow up the boiler than. It's been hard to find another way with that going on. Yeah, let's give it one more look. Oh yeah, they, they certainly want you to blow something up. Probably good idea before you run out of ammo. That is enough. Wait, what? Okay. That might have been a bit of a worse idea. About to get hot in here. Wait, where did that other guy go? Uh, Wish I had time to rescue no, a few I bottles of scotch. Yeah. Priority, Sean. At least you have them, but still. Wait. Okay, I have to ask. Would that happen if you blow up a boiler? All uh, Well, mostly, most of the time a boiler with... No. At Mythbusters at least tells that the... Uh, m modern boilers at least. <laughs> Would punch a freaking hole in your roof. Yeah, a hole in the roof, maybe. Set them to be on fire. Uh. Uh, it depends because buildings of this time would still be wood for a good part of it. Oh, and I I saw you spawning right in midair, little shit. <laughs> In what you read, luminescent. Yeah. Okay, if, he, if you two are going to volunteer to die first, then I won't stop you. 
Come on. Doesn't, doesn't even hold. Yeah, if if the place starts burning down, the <laughs> weak points are going to give. Yeah, but that's what quickly. Oh, okay, that thing finally ran out and I'm only left with the shotgun. I guess the boom for the boiler was enough to... Oh, Jesus! Crack a lot of beams? Christ, you see yourself, the damage. Try to cook breakfast. Okay, just how terrible of a cook are you, Sean? Or did you try to cook drunk? I guess I'm that question answers now. itself. <laughs> Okay, getting shot slows me down. Oh, fuck. Fuck me. Fuck. <laughs> uh, come on. There we go. And I'll be. Wait. Okay. For a moment I thought I'd sw oh. swapped out the wrong thing. Can I get your weapon and ammo at least? Okay, that's a lot less useful than the other one. And I did pick it up. And thank you for your donation. And... Oh, for a moment I thought he was standing in the fire. Oh dear. Yep. What the heck is that? That was you. Uh, <laughs> that is a bit of an over the top one. It's a. It's also a fireball! But it can't be Gandalf. Yeah, uh, and Mario wasn't German. Or isn't. Unless uh, he's been hiding some war crimes. Well, he, he is Italian. God in Himmel! This is madness! It's gonna be alright, darling. I'm gonna get you out of here. Hey, of course, if I'm Maria. Yeah. Okay. Uh, well, that was an easy exit. Uh, of course, there is still more remaining. But, yes, yeah. yeah, stone outside, wood inside. That was how most buildings, well, were and, yeah, were at the very least, I think. Yeah, but I think I've got some metal support beams and such for the floor. That's... Ready. However, then we're on I just realized way. something. Mm -hmm. Those boilers, there are two boilers, both massive, and they have massive pipes. So Come when on, you blow Maria. off, this is no place to linger. Yeah, the fire would spread through the entire place. Yeah, through the damn pipes. So we already have Maria, this type. Walking's too slow. Get in the car. I can see those cars just erupting in. Yeah, breaking whatever contains them. Yeah, I'm... Now I'm actually trying to think. A boiler explosion is typically steam, which is, well, extremely hot, which could, in turn, uh, set fire to things along the piping when it bursts. Oh. And there was a lot of coal in that room. Yeah. So well, coal, ex coal itself isn't explosive or anything, it's the heat generated from it that can cause, well, pressure and an explosion from that, but a, a steam explosion is mostly concussive, concussive force, I think. But yeah, it, it will still release an extreme amount of uh, highly pressurized extreme temperature steam and water. So you basically made a heat bomb? Hmm? You basically made a heat bomb, if that's the same term? Sort of, yeah. Just a gigantic one! Oh. It's kind of terrifying now. 
Yeah, but most boilers have uh, fail safes um, these days, specifically pre to prevent them from going boom. Yeah. yeah the Mythbusters had this. The Mythbusters had to intentionally sabotage the ones they were working with. <laughs> Maria, God in the heaven. I do not know how to thank you, Herr Devlin. I will never forget what you have done today. Seems His Majesty's government is in your debt as well. But don't expect a thank you note from Bishop. Bishop can go and shite. I don't work for me. German machine guns. Nazi soldiers! We're surrounded! They must have followed you here! What? That's impossible! No one can. Damn you, Devin! You've killed us all! No! Skyler! What the fuck has gotten into you? I can't allow them to take Kessler alive. There's too much at stake. I'm sorry, Sean. This isn't over yet. Get out of my way, Sean. Like hell I will. Oh, bloody hell. Don't make me regret this. Arm yourselves. We'll hold them off as long as we can. Okay. Now it feels like there's someone inside their team. Yeah. Okay, that's a hell of a knock on the door. Oh well. I'm not much for the sneaky stuff anyway. Oh, and it goes back to black and white. Okay, nice. Oh. Whoa! I kind of over <laughs> I looked in there. Yeah, get this thing that none of the leaders will take us. They have an East Rocker. Okay, come on. Ah, that, that would have been cool. That that one knocked over an explosive barrel behind him or Kill the sappers first. The walls must hold. Oh hello. <laughs> Motherfucker. Oh, no, this is ours. Oh, that's another one of those terror squads. And the, th the aim on that thing is off again. I th Sean! They're coming from the front entrance! I thought so. I gotta help you, they just but to confirm that you can't do all calls for machine guns. Right, uh, that's the car I just arrived with. Oh, I, I did not expect to get him there. He makes for a lot easier Watch target, the though. German sappers. They'll try to plant explosives on the building. Don't let that happen. Uh, not the smartest of sappers. <laughs> they aren't typically known to charge in in the middle of a gunfight. Out of ammo. And over here, dumbass. Okay, if you're going to make an easy target. Okay, one more. Third wheel. Push the other way! Push the other way! Okay. 
Even tank. more? Oh, okay, I, for a moment I saw that was a freaking tank. Oh, oh, come on, how dumb are you? You, you have it. He had a mounted gun and he jumped out. I just read on something. Terror squad people are over two meters tall. Over two meters. Oh, that's that. Okay, that's both of those out of ammo. Over there. They are attacking from the flank. Okay, now, okay, that side. Uh, I need ammo somewhere quick. There we go. No mounted guns here. Nope. And dealt with before they even could stop. Okay. Yet more. Oh, crap, I the leak. Come on, see all you guys got. Oh God. Do you hear that? Sounds like a fucking tongue. Yeah. <laughs> now the heavy troops come in. Uh, do we even have? Anti-tank weaponry. Oh, the the destroyed heck? tank. How do you want me to destroy that thing? Right? I don't have much in the way of explosives. Well, I have many explosives. Actually, it's not looking at me. Okay, big boy, get down. How tall are they? Oh, they're seriously over two meters. Nope, out of ammo for that one again. Uh, present for you. And have a second. Oh. Always swapping away from things. Ah, that disabled it. it oh. Ah! <laughs> Okay. Oh, love of. How much back does that push us? Or did that did that count as a win? That counted as a win still. What are they doing? Regrouping. They'll be back soon with reinforcements to burn this place to the ground. We won't get another chance to break out. Take the Kesslers and go. What about you? I'll buy you as much time as I can. Veronique. I'm staying with Luke. No. I've watched my friends die to protect that man. Don't let them die for nothing. Let's move. Go. We'll rendezvous at the catacombs. If he gets Veronique killed, he's getting his shotgun up its ass. Oh dear, that lamster is not- oh come on! And now something I only now noticed is that uh, yeah, people retain their eye color in the grayscale. Oh! That might be him. Uh, okay, I don't remember parking it like that. Um, what the heck? And... Just as soon as we get you to our laboratory in London. Blood cannot wash away blood. For your sake, I hope it can. Too much blood has already been spilled on your behalf. Papa, where are we going? Hush, my lips. We will be safe soon. And here I would want that you would be flirting with her, but no, no. Four worst things happened. I was honestly expecting to have to run a barricade or something, but they didn't even seal off the area. 
Yeah, and there's someone with a terrorist squad. They, they are. Extremely tall and extremely armored. Yeah. And you, you saw the damn gun. That's huge. Yeah, that, that really was just uh, an LMG made portable. Yeah, and maybe I'm wrong here, but won't the top people that tall and strong a bit of a rarity? Yeah. Then maybe they would be able to make a small telescope out of a few, but still. Yeah, I'm guessing things are a bit uh, alternate history with this because, well, we've already seen what was probably the Ark of the Covenant or something, or at yeah, least hinted and, to uh, it. Yep, yeah, and accidentally the not the radar, which they don't have or know what it was. Yeah, so I I wouldn't be surprised if uh, in this timeline they had some sort of uh, yeah steroid breathing. Uh, program going on or something. Actually, they were planning to have that, if I recall it right. Yeah, of course. I do know that uh, they did really love the use of steroids, specifically at the Olympics. Uh, at the Olympics, seriously? Yep. He survived. And he got here before us? Wait, where's Veronique? Do we have to go get the shotgun? Luke, where is Veronique? Where is she? It was chaos. We were separated. She... she was captured. Oh, you miserable bastard! She stayed for you! Sean! Give me ten men. I'll bring her back. I cannot do that. What? Why not? The operation will proceed as planned. Once the attack begins, we will need every man who can carry a gun. I can't believe I'm hearing this. We're talking about Veronique. Our cause is more important than any one person. Even Veronique. Not to me it isn't! You cannot leave, Sean. We need you to drive the Aurora. Find yourself another driver. I'm out. On the one hand there, Luke is partially right in that, well, the city goes before the uh, one person. The needs of the many outweigh the needs of the few and all that. On the other hand, she stayed for him and he doesn't even it was his responsibility, so technically he should be the one out here getting her. Yeah. Monsieur, well, he must be a bit gentle for it, but... Uh. But yeah, the, uh, sh the buckshot enema will be put on hold for now. Oh, that was fast. Sean, I may have found the means to locate Veronique, but we must act now, while the weather holds. Okay, Bryman again. But let's go work on a few side missions first. And also, we unlocked a perk in the last mission. Or let's see, where is it? War on Terror, turning Nazis to launch speed one, one happy trigger at a time. Point forty four pistol, okay. Dest destroy a Zeppelin and a wolf <laughs> tank doing the same alerts. Okay. Unlock Panzer Shrek in the workshop. Yeah, we'll, we'll be going for that then. Oh dear. Stealth kill five generals. Unlock uh, stealth uh, unlock touch of death attack. Wait, hold on. I guess we have something. Hmm? How does Bremen already know where she is? Yeah, you're suspecting that he might be the mole? I really hope he not, he's not. Hmm. Then, again, this is one of the moments and I hope I'm wrong. 
Yeah. I like it. Um, you know my track record. Never fuck with the dad. I deal in weapons. Let's see, fill up that. Fill up that. Point forty four pistol. Run round from this Yankee cannon will turn a crowd's insides into shepherd pie. Just watch your ammo, cause she's a bitch to reload. <laughs> Oh dear. Oh, and we have the Viper SMG. Oh, this one's silenced. Quiet Ooh. as a ghost and quick enough to stop a crowd's heart before he can reach for that whistle. A must for any serious collector. This is being like a Viper. Yeah. Let Don't mess with the Viper. Thank you. And the Terror MP60. And I'm pretty sure the MP models never went to 60. Wait, hold on. Look Maybe 50 is most. Hmm? What the heck is that mark on the gun? A V like? Or a shield? You gotta have brass balls uh, just to pick uh, one of these monsters up. Kicks like a mule, but you cut a jackboot into crowd confetti in two seconds flat. Okay, that confirms that there is something all with them. You might be steer steered uh, things you talk about, or. Something worse than steroids. Okay, what this one scrolled? And is it going to come back? <laughs> First time I found myself on the wrong end of uh, this monster, I nearly pissed me pants. The sound alone is enough to send hard men running for their lives. A true tight turner. So these descriptions are all from uh, Sean, then. And that does mean that there are more weapons than just the ones. In uh, question marks. Uh, that again. We have all of these. Uh, let's let's up our pistol ammo because well, I want to use the pis uh, this <coughs> the silenced pistol quite a lot. And oh yeah, flamethrower. We haven't gotten that one yet. It's. Uh -oh. Okay, um... Uh, Terror MP60? Uh, yeah. Let's see. 60 or 40. Silenced MG. Okay. And then that one there. And fill up the ammo. Okay. Okay, we, we can't interact with people here, but we can... Uh, who are... Dr. Kwong, okay, you're new. Dr. Felix Kwong, at your service. I have heard much about you. I hope that we can work together. That depends on what sort of work you have in mind, Mr. Kwong. Dr. Kwong, I am a clinical psychiatrist. Do you know what that means? I don't know. You like to dress up in women's clothes? <laughs> that is very amusing. I'm sure your sense of humor serves you well in situations where you feel threatened or insecure. There's no much threatening about a bloke wearing a dress, doctor. Never mind. Did you have a proposal to make? Despite what you might think, Mr. Devlin, I am a soldier. My battlefield is the human mind. My objective is to destroy the enemy's will to fight. It is a new field called psychological warfare. There's nothing new about it, Doctor. We Irish have been at it for centuries, on both sides of the pitch. Then, you understand why we must begin by sowing the seeds of fear and mistrust among our enemies. Our tool will be a traitor. In this case, a man who doesn't even know that he is a traitor. You got a crowd to turn coat. How? A combination of experimental drugs and hypnosis. I won't bore you with the details. Suffice to say, this Nazi will carry out my instructions. And what are those instructions? To assassinate a notorious Gestapo commander called Bauer. All you need to do is drive our impressionable German friend to Bauer's headquarters and make sure he completes his assignment. Now I'm playing chauffeur for a Nazi? Must be a chilly day in hell. Good day to you, Doctor. I'll let you know how your little scheme works out. Okay, one, a Manchurian candidate, I think that is the correct uh, trope, slash term. 
That is impressive work, and to was I the only one who noticed that uh, Dr. Kwong might have some neck issues there at a point or two? Yeah, and looks like his uh, sh uh, shirts might be a bit too small for his uh, <clears throat> gut. Yeah. All right then. He's on the corner. You need a different car. Yeah, let's go with this one for once. And a nice color scheme, uh, dark blue and silver. It is nice coloring. Mm. Yeah, I am. Um, I'm gonna try to keep an eye out of the terror squad, but there, there is something about so, them. What's it like being a Nazi and all? My name is Corporal Spitz. I have one package for Herr Bauer. Oh. What's in the package? Whiskey, sausages, porno magazine. Christ, that's one hell of a gift basket. Where can I get one? I am Corporal Spitz. I have a package for Herr Bauer. Yeah, I gathered that. You just sit tight, Spitzy. Bauer's place is just up the road a bit. Okay, so less Maturian candidate and more just plain old hypnotism yeah, and programming. Yeah, a bit trolled one by the sound of it. That yeah. one definitely is the place. Yeah. You go on ahead. I'll be waiting here when you get back. Yeah, I get the feeling he won't be coming back. I think we both know how this is going to turn out. Well, you just pushed the weight apparently. <laughs> Sorry. Halt! Zutritt verboten! Autor Offizier speaks. Ich habe ein Paket für Heimbauer. Bitte lassen Sie mich durch. Zu welcher Einheit gehören Sie? Woher kommt dieses Paket? Autor Offizier speaks. Ich habe ein Paket für Herrn Bauer. Das stimmt was nicht. Nehmen Sie diesen Mann fest und öffnen Sie das Paket. Fucking hell! Yep. The long scheme just went pear-shaped. I'll have to finish off Bauer myself. Yeah. Yeah, they, <laughs> he was a bit of a... A simple puppet, to call it that. Yeah, I want to try... What's the other moment that I am to try to find out of the effect? I Okay, someone was fucking eager. Yeah, I didn't expect it to fail, but I had a whole time seeing it succeed to begin with. Yeah, so much for uh, Mr. Kwong's. Uh, <laughs> yeah, everything. <laughs> Yeah, he needs to work on the hypnosis part. That was very bare bone. It's oh, I've been spotted. I guess it's just after the finger test of whatever they, what you call it, uh, what it's supposed to be called. Manchurian candidate. That one. And um, yeah, I guess we just happen to be the ones that did the game on the first attempt to fail horribly. Okay, dealt with. Uh, he won't be building anything more, because I'm pretty sure Bauer means builder. No idea. Uh, no extremely little German. It sounds very similar to the Dutch word builder, which is Bauer. Yeah, yeah Bauer. Uh, we say you're bigger. So I guess in the comma, all three have something in common. All starts with a B. And then to R. Pardon <clears throat> again for that. Yeah, no it was audible. Not a heck. 
Okay, I guess we'll be trying to help him perfect his uh, his method. Help him? Don't volunteer yourself to be no. hypnotized by that lunatic. Uh, I'd say uh, Sean has uh, had enough experience with uh, mind-altering effects <laughs> from <laughs> whiskey to uh, be resistant. And just cause. And no one better than I. Uh, wait. We're in Chinatown. Oh. I didn't really notice with the gray scale. <laughs> I, I thought and first noticed that this was something, something, uh, yeah, no, uh, in the clothes look started to look a bit different, then I noticed later the roofs. <laughs> and that's a lot of nuns. Why are there three nuns in a row? I don't know, but it won't mean you're a game of four in a row. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Just three more nuns coming in on the opposite direction. Should I be concerned? Mm. Yeah, the amount of concern you should have should be more than none. Well, true. I did scare two uh, Christians to try to uh, convert me once. Okay. Oh, well. It was in, the, in one of the Bible Belt cities when I went to dorm school. And there were people, two, two from uh, one of the church, the churches there, handing out pamphlets. And I just rose, I, one of them approached me, pulled the pamphlet, I rose my hand. Uh, this was my first day in school in the city. I just rose my hand, pamphlet. told it nice and calmly, so before he could speak, that sorry, I'm not interested. I um, already have a religion, and that's Odin and Thor. So please me alone, have a good day. And... and good gods! You should see their faces! They both were frozen! <laughs> Hands still out and looked like I was a demon! <laughs> yeah, with, well, with what you've said about your beard, you might have had a look to them, and that's to them. <laughs> Actually, my beard was not. Yes, it is. My beard was smaller than yours at that point. But I still had my eyebrows and hair. I can relax. Okay. On that note, though, I have had to shave uh, recently because it was getting too tall, uh, too long again. Yeah. After a while, you should just let it grow. It may itch, but once that itch over. It will just feel pleasant. Uh, the itching is more when I completely remove it and it regrows, but for now, let's continue with Brian. You look exhausted, yep. my friend. I think you need to get some rest. Veronique is out there. Somewhere in this city. I'll find her. I won't rest until she's free of those devils. Yeah, I believe you, Irishman. I may be able to help. I'm listening. We will tap into the Gestapo's private telephone service. If it is done correctly, they will never suspect. And then? Then we wait and listen. Veronique's arrest is certain to draw attention. What do I need to do? At this moment, a storm is brewing in the skies over Paris. When it breaks, you will place wiretaps in a series of telephone junction boxes. The interference caused by the storm will mask the signs of our tampering. It will be dangerous rooftop work. Just give me the taps. I'll handle the rest. You must finish placing the taps before the storm ends. Oi. Then I won't dally. Watch your step up there, Devlin. I will be listening. If I hear anything, I'll send you a message. Okay. Uh, okay, maybe he is not the culprit then. Uh, we only have a suspicion, uh, uh, but idea. we have no proof. Yeah. For all, it, it might, for all it is worth, it might be Luke himself, but we basically have no evidence one way or the other. Yeah, or could just be one of the red cases, someone we did not even know was there, that just, you know, one of those people you'll never notice is around. Yeah, one of the red shirts. Yeah. Oh dear. But I just realized I'm not a, a problem with his plan. And that is? You're going up a telephone pole, 
during a storm. Yeah. And this a storm that likely could cause problems with those pole lines. Usually all extreme winds along with that. I hope you heard that damn thing. Yeah, I heard the lightning. <laughs> yeah. People don't go up in trees or like uh, uh, no, not like it. Telephone poles do a thunderstorm. You may regret it deeply. Uh, if you would even live to regret it. Yeah. Because they will they will basically be giant uh, lightning rods. But I think this will not be telephone work, it'll be roof work, like you said. Bollocks. It'll be a I fucking miracle should... if I don't get zapped up here. But it sounds like there's still a good chance of me getting struck by lightning. Yeah, just look what there is on the damn roofs and you see yourself. There's plenty for lightning to strike here. My God, you are. Especially with your mess with radio pack packs. Those should not be on the roof. You do not. What the heck? Oh, come on, that's not the you want me to see that stop the lightning. Or a bullet to the helm. Help, help. Oh, uh, he is going to get uh, his... Okay, I, I've never really understood how wiretaps like this actually even work in reality. Same, man. It's only for the best that they don't tell you how it works. For yeah. Otherwise, people yeah. would try it. No, it wouldn't really. It wouldn't wor really work these days, since mo a lot of stuff is done wirelessly. Yeah. Come on. But it's a good idea. It's a technology left uh, not to be known. Mm. What? Oh. Oh, gee, there's a bunch that we still have to do. It's three out of seven. Okay. Uh, how do I get up there? Up oh, there, I get up there quick. This might piss off. This is going to piss off the sniper. I had to say, those rain pipes are sturdy. Even though they seem to, to be a bit below. Okay, quick way down. Oh, oh, come, oh, come on. How we saw that? I think. It, 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 what if he just landed on on nothing? Yeah, that would have been alerting. <laughs> Actually, I think yeah, anyone would be leaving in the truck if there was someone landing in front of them. Oh, hello, boys. Yeah, this would have ended up in a fight one way or another. Oh, both? Oh, uh, are you sure you want to use that here? Okay, there we go. And uh, now to just get rid of all the witnesses. Saint Germain? What? Yeah, this will help to get rid of the witnesses. Oh uh, yeah, this is going to be fun when I unlock this thing. Get rid of this thing. I, I get the feeling we've been here before. Now we've been in this region before because this is the church where we uh, played the assassin before with oh, yeah. uh, the father. Ain't that a famous church, that one? I can't say. Uh, it's not Notre Dame. I'm pretty sure that's not Notre Dame. Yeah. Oh, 
coming on that side and... Oh, hello. I missed you earlier. Cigars, cav caviar. Okay. Don't try to be shown again. Okay, and out. And here comes a message. I have a note for you. Appreciate it, mate. Speak to no one else. Trust no one. Either he knows Sean, listen carefully. who the I mole is. Information we seek and more. Find me. Speak to no one else. Trust no one. Bryman. Therefore, he knows that is a mole, but don't know who the mole is. Could be. Oh, he is a mole himself, but uh, it's one of those complicated situations. Yeah, you have you have basically no evidence one way or the other, so you can only go by your own suspicions. Yep, and you just hope that the true uh, villain makes a misstep and reveal themselves. Yeah, uh, let's go help Juan again. Uh, oh, think your name is an area of Juan. All right. Yep. Uh, well, I also talk about Germans. that didn't get. Oops. <laughs> Two even. <laughs> Nobody <laughs> apparently gave a shit about that speaker. <laughs> Come on, people. Beep, beep. Out of the way. Yeah, for a moment, I thought that was a nun there. Well, whatever you did to that kraut, it worked a little too well. Wonker never made it past the front desk. I have not, as of yet, perfected the brainwashing technique. I will have... Brainwashing. I'd rather my brain stay dirty. So what's the next step in this master plan of yours? Unfortunately, my plans must be delayed. The Gestapo has dispatched a pair of notorious assassins to hunt me down. I had a crucial meeting scheduled for today, but now I will not be able to meet my contact. The danger is too great. Unless, of course... You want me to cover your back? Is that it? There is a sniper's nest overlooking the square where the meeting is to take place. One of my colleagues will be watching the square from another building across the street with binoculars and a radio. If you position yourself in the sniper's nest, he will be able to help you spot any enemy agents in the crowd. I trust that you will kill them before they kill me. You could find worse odds to gamble on, Doctor. I'll do what I can. Okay, this will get interesting. Okay. You probably have to grab it. I do say, I do like the style that they have in Chinatown. It's a bit, a bit hybridized, I like. It is still European, except the roofs. Uh, I haven't been paying much attention to the roofs. Yeah, so. like a... That's what I can tell so far, at least until um, there's a bit more color in the area. Let's see. But okay, maybe only a few rules, like uh, the door entry groups uh, seem to have it, and that entry area there, of course. Uh, okay, I was looking at, at the building roofs, not the. Uh, I, I thought there was the there as well. But I thought it was there as well, but apparently they're more like just over the door or that entry thing there. Okay, I'll have to play with these for some time. The, the, I'm guessing these are remote controls. One car coming up. Hey, thank you. Yeah, that's, that's our same uh, Italian friend from before. Okay, where? Mm. 
let's not try that because I don't know if. Wait. I'm not sure if the car can go up the stairs there. And there's so many nuns again. Oh, wait, are you next for sure? Yep. Oh, okay, that explains it. Okay, hopefully the mission will give me a sniper rifle to work with because I don't think I'll be able to shoot much at long or too much distance with this thing. Though I have made quite a few sh good shots with it at range. Oh yeah, I recall that. Oh, uh, I recall I was to mention it uh, to you, but then uh, forgot about it. What was so much going on? Okay, that, <laughs> that was dealt with nice and easy. Okay, just go up. And I think this is the brand gun that Skylar was using earlier. Uh, one or two, uh, the previous stream. I think it was, it was the last stream she used that, maybe? Yeah. Uh, in the mission where we were blowing up the train tracks. Yeah, that, that, that's my, that was the last episode, yeah. Uh, wait, did you remember to change the name of, of this episode? Yeah, it's number six. Ah, good, good. What? Oh, uh, thank you for the scope rifle. <laughs> no, it still bugs me. Dora Funstorm, they send up these guys on the roof with antennas on the back. Yeah, they are for radio and uh, things to others. Yeah, but still, Dora Thunderstorm. Yeah, up on the. <laughs> up on the roof without anything nearby. Anybody there? Bonjour, Mr. Devlin. All that right. was stupid. I'm in position. Keep your eyes peeled. Kwong is entering the square now. I see nothing yet. Okay, he did say it was a pair. So I'm assuming we'll only have two targets. That's the contact. Sniper, on the rooftop. The building on the left side of the square. Shoot him quickly. Oh, no, keep your shirt on. The building on the right side of the square. Quickly, he's taking aim. Ah. Target eliminated. That should do it. Wait, someone's coming. There, on the street. Three more agents closing in. We are sending the car back for Kwong. Keep him covered. Come on! That's one. Excellent Miss. shooting, Mr. Okay, at least a bit easy enough. Devlin, Dr. Kwong has asked me to express his most sincere gratitude. Fine. Tell the doctor I'll be in touch. Okay. And that rocket doesn't seem to be very great on sniping it. Yeah, it, it's a bit wobbly, even when you're moving around. Typically, um, I yeah, I haven't played shooter uh, first-person shooters in too bit of a in a bit of time, but I think most of the time, when you're moving the cursor around, the wobbling stops uh, with the sn when you're using a sniper scoped. Most games, and when I have tried sniper rifles. I usually don't have the wobbling. Not at least not in this extreme manner. Okay, same way down as up. It, not that way, Sean. <laughs> it, 
Not that way either. Yes, third time's the charm. <laughs> third time's the lucky charm. Okay, no need to scream. Though that <laughs> that was a pretty big fall and uh, oh, nothing to see me, here. Sister. Okay, <laughs> you were a bit far away from the Where'd that nun come from? Do You're you next to a church, lad. Yeah, but I w when I last looked here, uh, the only nun I saw was her, I think. So she just <laughs> basically phased into existence as far as I could tell. Okay, let's see who's the closest. There are nuns everywhere. Let's Not very against nuns, but... When you, you can't... Uh, when, get a bit paranoid, like... If it, you can't turn a corner without seeing a nun. That's a big turning. Yeah, especially when they try to get... Uh, when they try to meddle with your business. Uh, yeah, you know what the best answer is then? Uh, it's none of their business. <laughs> Almost! <laughs> Almost! But you did not break me! Yet. <laughs> Yet. But yeah, I basically had to slap the hand to not. Not stop laughing. <laughs> Wait, I mean, not stop, not stop. I'm too tired to sell anything. Hello, Doctor. What sort of mind fuck you got planned for the crowds this time? The foundation of the fascist psyche is a nexus of fear and control. The tension between these opposing forces manifests itself as an obsession with power. Material, spiritual, and sexual power. Uh, this isn't about your thing with women's underwear, is it? For the last time, I do not wear women's clothing, Mr. Devlin. I'm just saying, maybe you should talk to a doctor about that. The Nazis have installed a monstrous howitzer in the Pantheon Dome. The cannon's massive barrel thrusts into the sky above Paris like an engorged pillar of masculine flesh, while the women of the city tremble in the eclipsing shadow. Suddenly I'm feeling a wee bit uncomfortable, Doctor. I'm afraid to ask where this is headed. Don't you see? The cannon is a symbol of German authority in this area. We will drive a splinter of doubt into the heart of the Nazi forces. We will shatter their confidence and render them impotent. I must confess, Doctor, that's one hell of a scheme. You may be the smartest man ever to slip into a pair of silk pantyhose. You may leave now, Mr. Devlin. Uh, Let's no. get to that gun and see what all the fuss is about. I can't tell if he actually thinks that he does or if he's just working him up. Um... Hilian, did you read the mission's name? Uh, I missed it. <laughs> you have a challenger. But that's not the mission's name, but... Uh... No, that's just... Uh... Let's see this. <laughs> Deutschland's Uber <laughs> Uh... <laughs> Are you gonna let that game... Beat you? Oh, it's not really a pun, it's just, well, <laughs> they stuck it right in there. Yeah, that it's rather... Yes, it is. If some kids succeed to play in this game, they actually, they will not understand what that meant. Then again, a kid should not play in this game at all. Yeah. Uh, that's a whole uh, issue all of its own with people who leave their parenting Whoa. to their games. Dr. Kwong wasn't wrong about the size of that thing. Ever hear of overcompensation? Uh, you stole my line, Sean. <laughs> 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 uh, 
tell me what you Did that happen or... Wait, no. That probably did not happen, I guess. Uh, well, I couldn't tell you what this place is supposed to be in the first... Enter the Pantheon. Okay, I, I don't... I don't actually recall if there was a... If there is... Or was a Pantheon in, uh... <coughs> Uh, in Paris, though I guess you could say this is just a, m a further continuation of all the uh, Freudian referencing, because Pantheon can be uh, heard of, uh, can be heard as Pantheon. Actually, gimme. Oh, oh, come on, I'm immediately spotted. Well, you did it quite openly in front of them. Here it comes. So don't you think they will understand what you're doing? Okay, take note. Future to make have a outfit. Make sure no one sees you. Change yeah. your clothes. <laughs> that should do and it. poof. Like a leprechaun, there and gone again. I think it's more like Going a cobra card or. I think I'm presented that Kubrickon? Um, it, can't it, say. It, it's related to Leprechaun, except they are the more violent and drunken variant. Mm, can't say. Yeah, I only learned them uh, from a video. And I think they are more aggressive than Leprechauns. You could, you actually could say they are the more evil costume of a Leprechaun. I know there's red caps, which are supposed to be the evil cousins of gnomes. Yeah, do, they're more, those are usually more depicted as a type of goblin than a gnome. Oh, yeah. feels jumpy. A goblin that soaks their caps with blood, and they have to do with or they die. Yeah. But yeah. The, I think the gnome variant is called blue cap, but also, also but they are, but the blue caps are also, which also are known, are also known as knockers. Knockers. <laughs> Due to in mice, they knock on the walls. Okay. Not uh, that kind of knockers, <laughs> Indian. <laughs> well, with all the Freudian uh, stuff. <laughs> Yeah. Th this one is very. Yeah. Innuendos. And I have a question. What? Sure, you build a cannon to help you spread the fear. Yes, I shared the one word for obvious reason. Spread fear over populace, but still. What for the... Don't feel a bit stupid when you put a tower in the, in the middle of a city like that. Yeah, it's probably an anti-air howitzer. Yeah, and you put it in a... Uh, then again, they did not care. Or uh, some history. They intentionally put uh, the headquarters in front of uh, a museum in Germany. And, yeah. of course, still to this day, Use a accidentally bomb that uh, building where the only spinosaur specimen was. Yeah. At least the first one. The only recent, uh, 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 last year or something, found more finally. Okay. And I guess that is the only place where Nazis and your main interest intersect. <laughs> I don't think the Nazis really cared about them. I think I'd go tits up without me. Basically. The, the museum owners there that did not supersize with them was the, them to move 
to please move all the stuff out of Germany and out from uh, the capital because of the bombing. But uh, now this uh, this it was a thing for because they know they didn't suppose it better than that. They just no, no, they stay here. They won't dare to bomb here. Yeah, then they probably didn't care much for dinosaurs because they didn't fit into their mythology and he is coming right for me. Yeah. It, it, was a, it was a museum, not only about dinosaurs, but many other things as well, but still. They only cared about their own fake history to care, so yeah, idiot. I really don't like Nazis, I really don't. Yeah. Uh, you, you'll find that 99% uh, of the uh, population will agree with you on that. Yeah. Okay, now how... Oh, here's the entrance. Hmm. Okay, there was something they have to collect that I overlooked. Okay, we can just... Okay, uh... I don't remember tapping E, so it automat it automatically sends me inside. So I'm guess I'll. Okay, yeah. enough of this ring around the rosy. I think I know how you get it. You walk a bit further away. Yeah. A bit naked there. Monument photograph postcards. Okay. I okay. swear this this mission. Oh, way too many loot you! <laughs> I think I accidentally broke the game a bit. <laughs> it won't let me back in. <laughs> um, okay then. Uh, load... Let's see that... No, we are not going back to that. Is there not a checkpoint or something? Yep, last checkpoint. <laughs> okay, we'll get that some other time. Probably on the way out. Yeah. But yeah, if you... <clears throat> if you look a bit at uh, Sean's outfit, those are his normal pants that he's wearing. So, um, yeah, he is out of uniform, which would also start to attract attention. Oh, come on. Did they seriously do that? Do what? Look at the statues. Yeah. They already installed metal statues of German uh, Nazi soldiers. Just bloody heck, they are cocky. Yep. I did not intentionally make that pun. <laughs> and the Freudian slips and references continue. Yeah, and I tried to avoid making one pun earlier when I talked about the cannon, but no, no. Instead, I make it one now. Let's see. Nothing to see here, uh, just a bit of anger management. Hmm. Let's see. Oh, that guy. Look at the box. Why does that box have holes? Hmm. On this. Ventilation or something? Or is there an animal in that box? It could also be for a hold for <clears throat> could also be handholds. Yeah, then again that was only in one side of the box. But maybe I'm just thinking too deeply into it. Maybe I'm just thinking too deeply into it. Yeah. Let's see. I am after all not seeing any gold box about. And oh good. By Odin, please, let there not be docks on steroids on this game. Uh, if there were docks, they probably would have been introduced already. But for now, I'll have to deal with Hans here to get up there to the 
from the stairs. Mm. Yeah, I was half expecting that. Still, I got that far. Oh. Okay, those shots are coming from downstairs. Remember, you are around live enemy anim ammunition. <laughs> yes. The hell were you climbing on, Sean? The air. Okay. <laughs> they spent quite a does this thing actually turn or is this just for show? It has to be turning, otherwise that, that, that's a little unnecessary. It, it, that it needs to be keep rolling. It must be tied to an engine somewhere. And we are going to make Contact. Oh, <laughs> out. <laughs> oh! Oh, an alien! That was an epic fail! Well, it would have been a bigger fail if uh, it had been in the middle of a firefight. That, yeah, this is a big ass fucking gun. Can we fire it? Alien, don't! Actually, I just imagined you using this to blow up both the human racing cars. <laughs> okay, dude. Is this supposed to be a reference to Assassin's Creed for a moment? <laughs> Possibly, um, bloody heck, just putting a cannon like that inside that... Oh, it's one of these again. Uh, okay, I didn't press to activate that. I feel like, I think I know what they're doing. They're Kid. using the thing as a living, as a mini shield, as a hostage, basically. Uh, last time we had special explosives for a cannon eat just a third of this size oh, that's gonna sting tomorrow. so uh, I very much doubt that this will do the trick yep now how do I, I destroy you right? it, well, since we're out of ammo for this one Ooh, I have someone heard me or is looking for me How do I destroy you? Are you destroy me? Well, a big suit from me. That's not horrible. Hmm. Okay, now part of me I hope there's a Swede in this game and they, they give you some kind of suit from me grenade. I also doubt that that will do the trick, but that that might do the trick. <laughs> <laughs> that did the trick. <laughs> Any troops? Uh, wait, what? One of the pipes went disappeared in three feet in air. <laughs> Fucking beautiful. If Doctor Kwong was right, there's gonna be a lot of limp bratwurst in the beer hall tonight. Oh come on! <laughs> <laughs> Marksman perk. Okay. Oh, he, he stole that from me. Uh, let's have a look at that before we head out. Uh, marksman, steady me hands better than a cigarette and a shot of whiskey. Okay, reduces drift. That's going to help a lot. Bye bye.
Okay. Oh, you you wanna come at me with that thing? <laughs> Yeah. Oh, no. Because you did that now with the pixelation. Ah, there you are. Hmm? Yes. The game has been seen until now, basically for one and a half hour. Already? <laughs> yeah, an hour and a half already, <laughs> okay. Yeah, time flies when you're uh, fucking Nazis and shit up. <laughs> Don't hug it. Use it. Embrace it. <laughs> In Don't. that way. Don't make it even necessary. Okay, that's some sturdy engineering. But a bit less uh, sturdy in the biology. Is there anything else I can destroy from up here? Oh, yes, indeed. I thought I heard the motor of another Zeppelin. Show's over. Okay, is there anything else for me to destroy here, or will I have to come back later? Ah, uh, there. Which means there will also be one on the other side. There you go, now I'm back with sandwiches. Mm, welcome back. Yeah, thank you. Oh, right, I just realized I forgot to say, be right back. Again! How does it be right back with half and so much screens at the same time? Okay, that that one must be just out of brain render range or something, or apparently not. Okay, it's a bit odd, some Things just won't be destroyed if they're not if in a di certain distance. Actually, let's uh, let's blow this one up, and then we go see what else we can destroy with this beauty here. And I already see one target. Never mind. Can we reach that one? Nope. What the hell did you play down? And we're still only at alert level one, apparently. What? It, oh, he got stuck for a moment there. Yeah. Oh, I don't know if this could be due to him, like, oh, it's just Sean and do me and it again. Okay, seeing as we can climb up here, there must be something up there. Uh, now there's another Zeppelin. Can we climb up there? Yes, we can. Er, no, that we... Mm. Yes, we can. That's a platform. And I was looking at the not the <laughs> the under room. This ceiling. Is that what you call women's skirt now? No. <laughs> okay, or is this just leading back to the cannon? Yeah, back to the cannon. <laughs> Mm. 
There we go. Oh, poor hands. <laughs> okay, hopefully we want you to push that over. Okay, back to our first date on this location, and yeah, I thought so. We can't. Yeah, uh, let's stop destroying things with wait, these wait, things. Wait, 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 hmm? Can you shoot the eagle? The Nazi eagle. Well, you can shoot it, but you don't break it. Well, you yeah. the storm and then zeppelin. Yeah, that'll make for a nice consolation prize, I hope. Yeah, and wait, I still realize. You shot down a zeppelin over the city. Twice now. <laughs> and a uh, little bit explain to you in, in, in simple terms. What happens when you blow up a ship? Boom. Wreckage. Yeah. <laughs> what? Wreckage. Yeah. And uh, where does the racket uh, in which direction does the racket land? Down. <laughs> Yeah, do you see the problem here? Nope. <laughs> okay, how do I actually get down from here? A message to the Dutch government. Don't let me get into the army. Okay, but seriously, where do I get down from here? Um, uh, like a bird? I think you display to you gravity. Oh, th there's the zeppelin. Or at least uh. part of it. <laughs> <laughs> and there's the other part, and that was me almost falling down. No, but that's a helmet. Yeah. Oh no. That's a crane holding a giant German helmet. There have been another statue. <laughs> oh, come on. Is this down? This is down. And I'm pretty sure I can hear yet another zeppelin. Uh, yes, there it is. Uh, oh, Sean! Oh. You're, you're lucky your arms are made out of steel cabling or something. Uh, but, yeah, in reality, that would have ripped his arm right off. Hey. Oh. Wait. It don't seem like the mother has some... ...stealing his bones and skin of her. Is that wolf? Is that wolf in the sky? Oh, uh, hello. Thank you. And goodbye. Uh, uh, yeah, well, we maybe find that back another time for now, just to get out of there. Let's see. I don't see a KW on the minimap. So I'm guessing we're done with Kwong for now. Yeah, first, now I wonder, why is a rock magazine contraband? Oh wait, it's Germans, of course it is. They want, don't want the soldiers to, uh, to be live distracted. the block. What? Be yeah, distracted. That too. that too, that too. Okay, who is the closest? Let's see, the Latin Quarter, okay. Oh, and... Okay, that area is uh, really high security then. Wait, hold on. Let's read that name. Yeah, Isla, Isla, de, Isla de the City. The, yeah. Yeah, the island of the city or something, I think. Yeah. Does that mean it's surrounded by water? I doubt that the name will probably be more figurative. And it seems that Captain Hook is the closest mission giver nearby. 
course. One car coming up. Yeah, where's our Italian friends? Oh well, we'll see uh, Lorenzo another time. Hopefully. I swear, if I see a gear that looks like we have about almost 10 rounds on the same screen, I'm gonna be suspicious. Very suspicious. Now let's uh, stay away from the churches then. <laughs> that should lower the spawn. Yeah, but I hope it's picked up to just put enough to just capture Sean and make him uh, repent. Yeah, they do that with uh, a barrel of kerosene, probably. <laughs> they, they needed to get the stench off of him. Oh, dear. Wait, wait, what did he show them there? The, uh, tran the travel documents that we've been getting from uh, the war prophet here. Okay. Due to pixelation, I thought he gave him the finger. <laughs> <laughs> well, that, that would have been a very impressed Nazi <laughs> if he, if he uh, <laughs> let him through for flipping him off. What, what, what was the thing back then? Middle finger? Hmm? What's the middle finger a root gesture back then? Not actually sure, but probably. The, with the way I've heard it is that the middle finger is considered the uh, quote unquote dirty finger because it's the one that people use to clean wounds and such. Because, well, it's the longest and you don't want to get more than one finger. Possibly uh, stuck into you, know, <laughs> you. You can imagine yourself that. I have never thought of that. Yeah, just something I randomly picked up at some point. A lot of my, in, a lot of my knowledge is just random trivia picked up here and there. Uh, same. So it has been a bit more specific of dying due to intro. But yeah, most of the yes, or what I learned from YouTube. All for others. Nope, I, st I thought I still had the silenced one, but uh, at least I silenced the witness. Yeah, I want to ask you why not use the silencer? Okay, time to create together another plot. The desert clans were enraged by the murder of the ambassador. They have refused to help the Nazis hunt down the free French deserters. It is a small coup, but every bit brings the Allies closer to victory. The Allies? I haven't seen much of them around here. We are a long way from the front lines, Irish, but we are all fighting the same war. At this moment, an airship is docking at the German supply depot in the Palais Royal to take on emergency supplies for the Africa Corps. An airship? Sounds like they're getting desperate. Then imagine how they will feel when we destroy their damn Zeppelin, along with the stockpiles of fuel and ammunition stored at the Palais. People around here are sick of the Nazis. The neighborhood is smoldering already. It wouldn't take much to start a fire. Then let's give them a spark. Okay, that's going to free another neighborhood. And the Africa Corp. I think that was run by Rommel. I'm not sure. I think... We um, I recall from a, a game that I know more by title than anything else, and even then I'm not remembering the title, but it was something like uh, hmm, Africa Corps versus Desert Rats or something, or maybe the... Hmm, yeah, I'm, I'm just plain not remembering. But yeah, I think the Africa... Either it was the Africa Corps that had the desert something nickname, or it was the Allies opposing them, which were the mostly Americans, I think. 
Again, no war experts, no history experts. Just a German jackass with a lot of trivia picked up. I recall yeah, the British were there, at least for a moment, even the French, but they had struggles there. And I think I misspoke there. I think I said a German jackass, but I, I'm a Dutch jackass. Yeah. Forgetting what you are? Poor oh, thing. Okay, here we are. Let's see. Let's try and sneak in somewhere. I could have used uh, a Panzer Shrek. Because if there's a Zeppelin here, I could have just uh, blown that up in one shot then. But if this is a depot, they'll probably have some sort of a uh, stationary gun to use instead. And that looks like a perfect spot for one. This time let's let's use the silenced weapon. I I do wonder actually what is the material around the balloon? I think that's actually cloth. So, if you shot a bullet at the balloon, would that be enough to ignite the helium? Uh, no, because it's not the the helium is kept within separate bags within the skin itself. Oh. <laughs> Um, yeah, basically the way I, I think it is, and I'm going only by... Well, we actually saw a bit of the inside of a Zeppelin earlier. Uh, those bags on the outside... Uh, no, the, the bags on the insides that we ran past... Those were the actual helium bags. Alright! Some way to my face is now, we have like a really high caliber shooting going around. Why is that part Uh I'm not seeing the part that you're meaning, but I'll just keep shooting. It's good for I am, so... Oh, there's a shot coming from behind us. Hello there. And goodbye. Really? Don't go up the... That's a strong building. Okay, and that is all that we can reach with this thing, I think. So, bye bye. Run! Okay, is there another nearby that we can use, or is there rest on foot? Okay, my pin that damn light I saw I wonder if I go that was. Okay. But it was a stepping for stopping me the hair. Come on. There we go. Now we got clean again. Uh, wait, I should not use it. Oh, uh, I should not stand next to that. Oh, here's the sapling that they were talking about. I thought I I was thinking those were pretty small to begin with. But yeah, I th I'd call that a uh, David and Goliath situation. <laughs> You're actually blew it off with a pistol. Uh, indirectly, I shot. Uh, <laughs> I shot. <clears throat> I shot some shells they uh, had left outside. 
I think he just died to friendly fire there, and thank you for doing my job for me. Where did that come from? Oh, there. Uh, keep the dog and fuck off. An explosion, explosion again. Uh, you're saying they bombed the quality? Yep. Oh. How are you still alive? Lots and lots of determination. This is not on the tail. Come on, die already. Not you, Sean. Oh, I killed one of them and now the other one is in there. <laughs> Something tells me Sean have many broken down and probably very dead. The fuck is in blind? Yeah, he'll sleep it off like any hangover. And yes, people. With enough strong blows, you could temporarily blind a person. If I remember right. Uh, something about the uh, blood getting forced out, I think, by the back and forths. Yeah, and you just basically confuse the brain. And it can take a moment for the wiring to correct itself. Yeah. I love that the primeval field, so I will take that with a grain of salt. Yeah. Uh, still more. Oh. That's a bit too close there. I can't destroy the path though. I was about to say apparently not, but apparently I still can. Yeah, if you look up a bit. Bye bye. If you died there now, I I would don't know what I would do. Okay, I th there's three things left. I'm guessing those are the zeppelins and something else. <laughs> uh, let's see if we can find out uh, if we can find some explosives to uh, hit those. But then you are su you were surprisingly calm for someone who has been in an area that's been in a complete war zone. <laughs> Perhaps it's like a uh, Wonder Beyond situation. The watchdog has uh, got the way to use to him. Oh, hello. Okay, these are some sturdy lights. But they do look sturdy. It's actually this... It's not the balloon? Or maybe it is? Wait... That certainly it stuck to a line. Yeah. What happens yeah. if it cut the line? Oh, come on. Oh wait, we can do that! Yeah, okay, it, it's a bit specific. It seems you don't need to shoot him in the nose. Which is actually somewhat accurate because the nose is 
with shells is more for penetration. The payload is in in the in the back. Yeah, no, the penetration also pushes back so it can explode usually. It wants me to blow up this. What the heck did you? Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Oh, pixelation on the bench. I think that marker bit me wrong. Because I think it's supposed to be this. <laughs> okay, that's a literal lead rain. Or oh, I think it means the zeppelin after all. Yeah, it's the zeppelins that need to go. Okay, I need to find a bazooka somewhere. Oh, that actually works. Okay, these are only little zeppelins. Zeppelins. Oh. I thought one of the world to land on that thing. Okay, and this is... Yep, that's this place, uh, quote-unquote, liberated. 6,000 <laughs> contraband. I I think we'll be good. Oh, I say that right as I run out of ammo. There was... Wasn't there one here? Okay, did very quick on his feet. That's that Zeppelin still up there. Yeah. I'll take whatever this is. Okay, that is one advantage of a uh, Zeppelins is that they give air. Well, the, you can park them over somewhere and use them for well area suppression. Bloody painful that was. Yeah, but it can also be easily taken down. Yeah. Yep. Uh, okay, that is hovering in the air. <laughs> and the last piece of explosives. Oh, hello there. I don't think that they even have a limited amount of the, of they can carry. Yes, they are massive, but... I think they have quite a small weight, uh, a smaller amount they can carry. Room, room, coming through. Oh dear. Oh them. Oh, oh that... Okay, <laughs> that's... That's a lot of attention I'm getting. Uh, bye bye. I think that's the. The stuff uh, secret weapons. <laughs> okay, now I'm a bit cornered. <laughs> uh, stuck between uh, an assault zeppelin and oh, an army outside. <laughs> uh, where do I get find another exit? <laughs> Could be worse. Could be no step more to the number two. Those armed nukes. And it is not. This isn't red alert here. Yeah, I said it could be worse. No. Oh. Uh, uh, did we just get hit by shrapnel? <laughs> we just got killed by shrapnel. Oh well, at least we're out. Okay, that we'll lose all the weapons and grenades. Okay. At least we finished the mission. Yeah. Oh, back here. Been a while. Are you got bongo drums? Got what? Bo I think it's called bongo drums. 
Um, yeah, bongos. Search for postcards near tourist spots. Okay. Okay, yeah, that, that was uh, a lot of fun. To, uh, oh, here comes another message. Yeah, Take this. you okay. might want to try a bit you. more subtlety next time, dude. <laughs> the Legion owes oh, you a right. debt of honor, Devlin. You have paid in blood for our freedom, and we will repay you in kind. Okay, yeah, but we'll have to call it here, though, because we're at the two-hour mark. But I'd say that was quite the explosive uh, finale for the episode. <laughs> you could say that. Okay. Uh, so, <laughs> anything else to comment for now? Uh, what did I can think of the moment? Yes, we spent quite an event for the episode. Yeah. I, I can see why people like this game, because it is just a ton of fun. I have uh, mentioned this to a few people, and they did say that they liked it as well. It, it's a bit of a... Uh, it's a bit sad that this game didn't get the attention that it probably deserved back in the day, but... Um, yeah, I, I'm not sure what else came out in 2009. Uh, maybe if I finally remember to remember something, I'll look it up uh, before next stream. Yeah, it might be some other game that uh, overshadow it or something. Yeah, Brutal Legend came out in the same year. Yeah, I think it was 2009 was the year where many good games came out. Yeah, that can explain it as well. Yeah, for it was before, you know, where many game companies still had a soul. Yeah. Okay, but yeah, anyone who has been watching now later on uh, on YouTube, uh, this has been the Saboteur yet again, and I, I'm going, I get the feeling we might be a, a quarter through the story, maybe, or not, a, maybe a third to a half, rough guess, but yeah, we'll be playing this game for quite a few, uh, quite a while longer still. <laughs> And I, I hope uh, people aren't getting bored of it. I certainly aren't. I don't. I'm quite happy, and I, I thought that would be fine. It's boring, but no, I found yeah. it hilarious. Yeah, th this was this was a good little find, and I, I'm happy that I remembered this game, even if it was only because of the striking uh, visual uh, presentation with the, uh, well, grey, black, and white when you were in uh, enemy territory. I think I'm also would remember it if I had played it, uh, Sean mostly. Yeah, Sean is fun. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, for now though, we'll have to call it here. So again, anyone who's been watching now later on YouTube, thank you for watching, and until next time. Uh, uh, I I messed up my outro. Uh, thank you all for watching, and you in particular, Drakir. Oh, you're most certainly welcome. And, well, next time, more saboteur, but until then, until so then. Be safe, folks. <laughs>